all right guys so in this video we are going to be going to try an all range team and this time around we're going to be starting off a little bit differently because we are going to try and beat this dragon uh in the beginning all right instead of going into the arena we're going to try versing the dragon and as you guys can see we have a twizzy gummy rye cookie uh tiger lily as well as pastry and a beet cookie all right a beet cookie is in there only level 30 here but i am not going to be wasting my esp star jelly right now for this video at least because if you guys know dark cacao as well as affogato are going to be released in the next update which is very soon all right in a couple of hours so we are going to be using this team right here. So going over the toppings real quick. Twizzly Gummy using three of the Juicy Apple Jelly, two Searing Raspberry. No damage resist, uh, just focusing on crit as well as attack and cooldown. Uh, Riot Cookie is going to be using five of the Searing Raspberry. 57.4% attack as well as crit percentage a little bit and damage resist at 8.1%, 2% cooldown. Bee Cookie is going to be using three Searing Raspberry, two Solid Almond. About 32.6% attack as well as 7% damage resist and then pastry cookie three singing raspberry two solid almond 11.1 percent damage resist uh 31.1 attack all right and then we have tiger lily right over here using two of the swift chocolate two solid almond one caramel and it is going to have 10.5 percent cooldown so it is important for tiger lily to have at least 10.3 percent cooldown to have a three second start inside of the arena that's why i have this Equip right now, and we have about 17.9% damage this. Alright, so, and the treasures are going to be the monocle, scroll, as well as the slingshot. Alright, so now, let's go and try to beat this dragon with the all-range cookie. Alright, here we go. Let's go, let's go. I'm just going to do it at 1.5 speed, um, just so that we can try to speed this thing up real quick. Um, and, okay, that was a good chunk of damage. I mean, Rye cookie just... Does a lot of damage, right? Right, does a lot of damage, so that is a good thing, right? Uh, one of the best cookies for um, the actual single hitting, but I got canceled right there by the stun, which was a fat mistake. But you know, we'll just we'll just deal with it for now. All right, I'm just gonna use Monaco right there just so that I can keep my cookies healthy. Maybe I should have waited a couple seconds. That was a that was a mistake. Alright, I think that's gonna be... Yep, that's the first, uh, you know, HP bar gone. And we have 1 minute and 40 seconds remaining. Uh, before we are going to be finished uh, with this run. Alright, I don't... I honestly don't have any, like, expectations of actually beating this stage with an all-range team. Um, I believe we can at least get to where the number is right over here around a third of the dragon's HP. Uh, I think that is going to be a place where we're going to end. Okay, so let's just see how well we do. And dude, my cookies are getting low. Come on, come on. Alright, I'm just going to have to do the uh, healing right there. He's going to probably do the stun soon no not yet okay and there's the stun and dude they are so low in hp right now it's kind of scary right here and pastry actually died right there which is not good uh we have we have we reached the third we have 10 seconds remaining all right i think we can do one more skill we should be able to get one more skill off and that is going to be it. All right. So, of course, like I said, we probably can't be the dragon with this team. But still, Ryan Cookie doing over 4 million damage right here. Uh, Twizzly doing 2 million. Uh, Pacer doing only 1 million as well as uh, Tiger Lily doing 1.6 million. And B Cookie just doing 75,000 because, of course, she died in the beginning. But there you go, guys. That's going to be it against the dragon. But now let's jump right into uh, some friendly battles this time around. Because if you guys remember, Arena did reset today. And I'm actually very close to top 500. So I don't want to be losing my trophies right now. So let's get into some friendly battles and see how well this team is going to do against some of the teams. All right, guys. So... Nothing has really changed except for Twizzly Gummy Cookie here, right, guys? We are going to be using five of the Solid Almond just because Twizzly Gummy is going to be up in the front. So we are going to have some damage resist that is going to allow her to survive a little bit more tank for the team. So we're going to have 38.6% 
damage resist as well as 3.2% cooldown and 1.6% crit. And instead of the slingshot, of course, we are going to be using the jelly watch. Now, here we go. We're going to be versing this kind of a standard meta team here uh, against a sea fairy, frost queen, hollow berry, content eclair. Uh, everybody using the broken cookies right here, guys. And then right here, the only downside for their team is that they're going to have a lower treasure level. But let's see how well we do against this team. All right, here we go. And there we go. Tiger Lily going to be stunning. But man, just, just look at that. Just the fact that they have like a massive amount of stun freezes. Just like some of these cookies that need a really, really good and sturdy like front uh, line. As well as some utility are just not going to be able to do anything. Especially someone like Pastry Beat as well as Rai Cookie. Uh, they're just not able to do anything because... They need somebody to be in the front tanking for them. Uh, they need somebody in the uh, middle to do some stunning and things like that. But Tiger Lily stun is only going to stun uh, our uh, Hollow Berry there because we don't have Ginger Brave to push them together. And it's just not going to work out uh, as much because, you know, Sea Fairy, Frost Queen, Cotton, how are you going to beat that? As well as Eclair, right? Alright guys, this time around, we are going to be versing this uh, Sorbet team. If you guys remember, I shared this team with you guys before. So let's see how well we do against a no tank versus a no tank. Here we go, here we go. But the thing is, they have Pumpkin Pie. I guess Pumpkin Pie is going to be considered a tank uh, to majority of the people here. And, but, wow. Okay. That was, uh, I don't know which one was faster. Which one was faster? This one or the last battle? 14.75 uh, seconds. Uh, Pastry did the most damage this time because she was able to survive and shoot at the enemies. Uh, but the rest of them just no damage at all. Uh, Frost Queen, of course, doing that freeze. It's just going to be insane. And Pumpkin Pie. Pom Pom is just too strong. Alright, this time around, another uh, kind of a very uh unique team right here it's kind of quote-unquote one-shot team but we do have almond as well as uh pure vanilla in there uh and we are going to be versing somebody with a lollipop scythe and a scroll so let's go and see how well this is gonna work out all right let's see let's see what we can do tiger lily come on team okay that was um wait we got rid of their sea fairy though Okay, some progress. Progress this time. We, we at least killed off one of the enemy. And this time around, it lasted about 25 seconds. So, not bad at all. Well, we got rid of their sea fairy. So, I say that is a that is a decent job uh, of versing a, somebody who has a pretty good team, right? So, there you go. Alright, guys. Well, I don't think this team is ever gonna do like a decent job inside of the arena even against a friendly battle uh because like i said before range cookies are supposed to be in the bag shooting away and using their skills but without a front line or any uh utility inside of your team such as good uh, area stun silence immobilization uh knockbacks and things like that you're just never going to be able to have their full potentials come out inside of a all range team and that is the reason why balance is so important it doesn't really matter about having high like you know attack power and things like that having balance is very very important and i hope that while you guys are watching uh, these videos of me, me just trying out all these all class teams right i hope you guys really understand how important uh having a good balanced team is when it comes to the arena as well as the world aspiration but anyways guys that's gonna be it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it and you guys are enjoying the series i will be doing an all charge cookie uh team when dark cacao cookie is released and we will be trying them out as well anyways guys if you guys enjoyed don't forget to hit that subscribe button as well as the like button and also don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you guys are notified when i do post new cookie Rank kingdom videos as well as when i do go live on youtube anyways guys thanks for watching once again and i'll see you guys all next time